District Attorney Susan Hawk is opening up as promised about her treatment for depression and what led to her long leave of absence. Saul is live in downtown Dallas with the story. Saul. Yeah, and Susan Hawk is back on the job now here. Uh, she says that she is ready to answer questions, questions about uh, where she's been, you know, what's going on with her professional and personal life, and whether she can continue to lead as Dallas County's first female district attorney. In an interview with a D Magazine, Hawk opens up about her depression diagnosis, her failed marriages, her addiction to painkillers, and her thoughts of suicide. Hawk returned to the job just last week. She voluntarily checked herself into a rehab facility in Houston, but according to D Magazine, was committed when she told a nurse that she wanted to kill herself. Uh, she spent a little more than two months there. At times, she said in the article, uh, studied ways of killing herself using the blow dryer or her purse strap. In the D Magazine story, before getting treatment, Hawk had serious bouts of uh, paranoia, thought that her phone, the computer were being monitored, accused her top assistant of breaking into her house and stealing a photo of her. Now, she declined to talk about his firing or the firings of several employees, calling them personnel matters, but admits that she suffered from, again, paranoia, attention deficit disorder, and depression, according to D Magazine. Now, Hawk also talked about how she wanted to quit her job actually several times. And again, she's only been on the job uh, since January of this year. But now she says that uh, she is committed to the job. She made a brief statement yes, uh, last week, rather, when she returned uh, to uh, her job. But now uh, she says she has tools in place to help her, and that includes weekly appointments with a therapist, uh, carefully controlled medication, and even guitar lessons to help her, you know, release some of the stress. Reporting live in Dallas, Saul Gatza for Good Time.